which machine is better the four millimeter stroke or the 3.5 but before we do that don't forget to like and hit the subscribe So let's get straight onto the video. Now, both of these machines are exactly the same except for the stroke. One has a four millimeter, one is 3.5. They both come in the same packaging, brilliant carry case. You get the charging dock, batteries, USB, uh, but you don't get a plug. Now, these are very expensive machines now the reason i have two is just because of the style of work i do which is japanese One machine isn't better than the other. The only difference is the stroke. So let's jump on to the 3.5. This was the first one that they bought out. This is a good all round machine. It's perfect for color blending, color portraits, smooth black and gray. If you're a color realism artist, this is the machine you would want to get the 3.5 um, it's got the sensor drive so you could hit it to soften the machine up a little bit or if you want to do some basic line work some solid color on one area just put it on steady mode which is just like the direct drive machine um, i use this machine virtually ever since it come out I lined with it, coloured with it, and shaded with it. But I did want a machine that was better at lining. And that's why I bought the 4mm stroke version. Don't get me wrong, this one can line really good. But this one is better. They can both line. This gets the job done, but this gets the job done quicker. I also prefer this for colour work, even, even colour blending. If I want to do some blends and work an area a bit longer, I just hit the sensor drive and soften it up. I don't do any black and grey with this, no wind bars or, or anything. I will jump straight onto that machine for this. So at the minute, all black and grey work is done with the 3.5 and all solid colour work and line work is done with this. Now which machine should you get? That depends on the style of work you do. If you're a black and grey artist, colour realism artist and you're only doing a few little lines, get the 3.5. If you're a dot work artist, solid colour tribal and your work needs some strong lines get the four millimeter stroke you won't go wrong now i would like cheyenne to come out with a 2.5 obviously for real smooth grays but it can be done with this but it would just be quicker the reason i have two is it speeds up my tattooing process i don't like dragging things out i like to get the job done that's why I own two machines. Now, if you're an all-round artist, um, you do a little bit of everything, I'd get the 3.5.
the uh, four millimeter stroke is a bit more specialist for your strong lines and strong color work but they're absolutely fantastic machines the batteries last a full session if you scroll down my channel i've also done separate reviews on each machine but either way whichever machine you get you can't go wrong and cheyenne if you're listening please hurry up and release the 2.5 and i'll see you in the next video